All right, it's Ralph Raven, aka Nefarious Yordle, and we're playing Warwick again in ranked. Back from a horrible Shivana game, and now I'm looking to just show these people my Warwick. Hopefully, it's a little better. All right. Well, if this guy doesn't want to pull for me, then sure. And if he does, then sure. I don't care either way. It's just a few seconds of time. Not too big of a deal on Warwick. It's not like a Shivana. I would spam the living hell out of them if this was Shivana, right? If he autoed that, that would be perfect, because it would be pulled out a little bit, and then I don't have to smite it. That's why I didn't smite it initially, because the smite also pulls it out, of course. Now, I can just take these three camps so I don't have to come back to this bottom side anymore. Makes my route a little bit more efficient. But it does make me slower as well. It's cost benefit against a Kha'Zix. I don't think I can do a whole lot in his jungle. Depending on what route he goes. If he just goes for a standard 3 camp route, I can't do shit to him. Stay on almost full health against a Kha'Zix. That is also very important. There is Kha'Zix. Very late response. Haha. <laughs> oh, I actually instinctively press two, but I don't have Tiamat, do I? Ah, I can't kill him with single auto. Might be able. Nah, I'm not gonna go for it. Unnecessarily risky. I can loop around and dive him if he stays. Okay, this guy's not going for that. That sucks. Oh, what? <laughs> ah, nice. We baited the flash. Ah, okay. Got the barrier. Right. He's out of mana. Alright. So, at least that's both summoners. <laughs> the, the Ari just completely screwed up after that. I couldn't really save her. The, all I could have done is not flash because of his barrier. I didn't think of the barrier. Kind of peripherals that you should pay attention to once you get to a certain level of elo. And that I still struggle with. So stopwatches. No stopwatches this game. Barrier on zero. Right? Exhaust instead of ignite. Unteric. These kind of things. You have to program that into your mind. Right? This, this takes time. It takes practice. Alright. So. That's a ward by Kha'Zix. I'm just going to take that. I'm just gonna take my wolf on spawn. So I presume he already took the other camp. Right, that's a good smite. Just making sure I did it correctly. Oh, what? He didn't take that? What? That's weird. Oh, I, they didn't have wards? What? So, Kha'Zix goes into my jungle and doesn't ward anything else than under the turret. Weird. What the hell is up with that? I would like to know what the hell that kind of strategy is. Alright. They saw me again. Back the fuck off, dude. Back the fuck off. Oh, are you helping me with this? Alright, I'm, I'm trying to donate this. I'm not sure if that's a good idea, but... Good job. I, I wish I could say the same, Ari. I wish I could. Off the wave, dude. Oh, 
Hey, got them all. Gotta catch them all. Da -da -da. Well, that was bad. Which part? I don't know. I don't think they're flaming me. I think they're flaming themselves for that. There's no way they have a ward here. So if he jumps in here, that's just dumb luck. But in their defense, though, it's kind of obvious that I'm doing this. So I do consider this kind of an error. So I hope I have enough time to get the blue buff and the other buff. See these these deep wards, they are so effective. Oh whoops, undo, undo, I'm gonna go for an entirely different buy. Ah, I don't wanna wait for 15 gold. So obvious. Alright. You got him though. Alright. Rough one. He backs there, I'm fine with that. versus three. This guy's getting boned by me. I have to flash on this to get the auto before he gets mega. Alright. Well, I don't know if, if he if he came earlier, that would have been a lot cleaner. But yeah, we're still stomping them, so it doesn't matter too much. Right, you take that, you take that, you take that, you take that, you take Holy. Two hundred IQ. That's all I can say there. Two hundred billion IQ to not auto a fucking Ward with one HP when it's like, hello, there's a ward there, there's a ward there, there's a ward there, it gives you experience, just auto it, there's a ward there. And they just refuse to do it. They just refuse. Sternly refuse. There's no movement in, in them at all. They just, just, they just don't want to do it. Right, I didn't know I had that already. I guess now I can also buy cloth armor, which is... Eh, eh. Phew, alright. This game is already close to being donezo. Really? Alright. Cool, 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 cool. I could even buy a ruby crystal if I wanted to. I think I'm gonna go with the whole tab I set up. Maybe buy two wards instead of one. Eh, I don't know. A little bit much. Probably won't need a lot of it. Mmm... Goku Super Saiyan. Not Saiyan or Saiyajin. No, no, no. Saiyan. Clear those minions and then come here. Holy. You took this route instead of just walking straight up there. It's just like. Why? Could you explain?
explain to me why? Because he's gonna run up here. I already know that. We want to donate that? What? Oh, fuck. Give me that pink ward. Give me that pink ward. Get the fuck out. Nice, 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 nice. Good catch. That is it. That is what we wanted. And then they push top of this, and it's just we're gonna get a shitload of turrets, and it's gonna be very hard for them to do anything. Oh, why don't you just auto the turret? Just watching this cat play makes me so sad. It's so clunky. Like, she's literally walking through a weird route to blue, so I get it. She donates the kill to me in mid lane. She doesn't an auto the ward I ping 20 times just these little things where it's just like what are you doing but she just lands some charms and she doesn't position herself poorly and we get everything right like it doesn't matter in terms of the game's outcome so I guess it should be all right with that right. this game yeah going pretty well they got another kill over there. Everybody get kills. We get some regeneration stuff going on here. Good for the Ari. Uh, Ari follows up on that. See, her move movements are not terrible. They're just not good either. Give me that. I don't know why she doesn't... Ah, uh, I guess. I can't do that if there's Tarek behind that. I just can't... Oh, what? Tarek's here? What? Gonna make sure he doesn't. I tried so hard, but in the end, it didn't matter. All right, he's dead. He didn't have stun. Lucky me. Enough of me trying to donate this to Ari. Yeah, this guy's done. This guy is done with the game. That's clear. I understand. I would be done too. Hmm. It's gonna be a hard one. I'm not gonna ping them back. I, I mean, I know they know. I, I'm not gonna be a dick about it. Nah. Just, just a good, just a good Warwick player, buddy. Just a good Warwick player. Like, I'm not a Smurf. If you look at my gameplay, I'm making so many fuck ups. If I play Shivana, I'm actually doing worse than average in this elo. I ain't no Smurf. I'm just a very good Warwick player. That's all it is, and Warwick is very strong right now. That combination. Of being like that diamond 5, diamond 4, diamond 3 in that area. And then having a really good champion. That's really strong and you're good at. That's perfect, dude. Yeah, then, then you're performing very well. Look at this win rate. I understand that people would be like, hello, are you smurfing? That is a 73% win rate overall. Over 50 games. Playing at this point in high platinum. And you have to imagine, like, my Warwick stats. 81%! 81%! 
It's like Warwick Smurf question mark. Not true. That's why I play it. It's that simple. It's very strong. Like if I don't know. I don't know who thinks it isn't busted. I think everyone thinks it's busted, but all right. It is not as effective in high elo because you can work around the ultimate very well and you can kite him around because he has to get in Q range. So it, it, it is not as effective in, in high elo as Skarner. Skarner you cannot get away from. Skarner can just get righteous glory and a shit ton of mobility and just walk up to you and ult you. There's nothing you can do as a professional team in competitive level play people can still do that and still catch you up right and that doesn't work as well with warwick that's why you don't see these champs like warwick you would not get a single ult off right if, if people are extremely good shiny requaza let me look that up uh okay that's pretty good stats All right. Well, that's it for this one, guys. If you if you liked it, consider leaving a like. If you uh, want to see content similar to this in the future, consider subscribing because, you know, uh, yeah, I will be making more of this. Did I already say that? I was confused. I was reading something. Very rude of me not to pay attention. Sorry. Hope you enjoyed it. See you in the next one.